Hey everybody, Susie Q here and we're at Q Aquatics. Today is number three of a series of three videos. So today we're going to be going over things that I'm intending to do for next year. So let's take a look at seven of my goals for 2019 in order for me to improve my content for you. Let's go check them out. Number one. The first thing is I want to up my game with equipment, audio, the, the camera quality, the background shots, the, the B-roll, the editing transitions. I want, to, I want to up my game, not only with the equipment, but also the content. So that's the first thing I want to do. Number two goal. The second thing is I want to add a live stream here and there as a bonus, but I want to make sure I structure it just like my videos with the outline with a purpose so it's re-watchable that it brings some kind of value um, and don't get me wrong i love connecting with people the q a the reading the chat and just talking that's huge but i also want to make live streams without the editing but be a little more formalized with it so that's one of the things i want to start doing number three goal the third thing i want to work on for next year is creating a logo that more encompasses not just my aquatics but my exotics the reptiles i'll start off with my aquatic turtles and my land turtles my axolotls the amphibians the poison dart frogs i got a couple um lizards i got some leopard geckos crusty geckos two fire skinks that are just awesome and my my pet not necessarily my hobby um sapphire my blue tongue skink so i want a logo that's going to incorporate not just the aquatics but also the exotics number four goal so number four i want to work more on collaborations with other youtubers with other fish tubers i want to work together and create some content maybe not an interview style but because there's a lot of great interview interview content out there but maybe you just work with another YouTuber. So I want to work on that. See, I don't have a, an actual plan because these are things that I'm looking forward to in the future. Here's my number five goal. So another thing I want to start doing is when I have this equipment set up or when I'm filming, I want to film enough for like two or three videos. Um, I might not have the intro or outro, but I want to film while everything's set up and everything's going and Maybe I'll do a you know water change on the basement tanks. Maybe that's the time to do a couple different videos, at least film enough for a couple different videos. So that way, maybe on Monday and Tuesday after I film on the weekend, I can do some editing, you know. And then Wednesday, I could put together the um, thumbnail, and then upload it, and and use the scheduler so it's uploaded ahead of time and get caught up. So, and when I say caught up, knowing that I have the next week and a half, two weeks of video scheduled and working on the next couple ones. So I want to start to incorporate something like that. Number six goal. I want to make sure I'm adding value. I'm going to focus on my, I think it's called the value proposition. What is my value of my channel? What is it that I want to offer? And maybe I already have that, but I'm going to take a deeper look at that in this next upcoming year. Here's my seventh goal for 2019. And then the seventh thing I'm gonna absolutely keep in mind, I want to enjoy this journey. I'm doing this for fun. I'm doing this because I am having a blast. I love learning. I love learning about the nitrogen cycle, the fish, the communities, where they come from, conservation. I like learning about the editing and the uploading and the YouTube algorithm. I like learning about how to do collabs and all that. Just enjoying the journey. If it gets to be too stressful, or I don't want to get burnt out. Like I, I want to make sure and keep my focus on enjoying the journey. Um, so, and that's also the main reason why I wanted to, sh to, to update uh, Q Aquatics to Q Aquatics and Exotics, because that's my passion. That's what I'm enjoying. That's what I want to share. If you're interested in seeing the challenges that I experienced last year, check out this card up here. Yeah, thanks for watching and thanks for watching this series. If you're interested in seeing the tips that I've learned over the last year, check out this card. You guys are awesome. Thanks.